Hello family, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Anthony, and I am so glad you stopped by. Uh, if you like Dollar Tree hauls and other crafty videos, please feel free to hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you be a part of my small little YouTube family here. And to all my uh, returning subscribers, thank you so much. Thank you family, I really do appreciate you. So let's jump into this Dollar Tree haul. Uh, we will start off with the fashion mask. We finally found some fashion masks. I had asked my husband if he would go uh, up front and see if they had the masks in. We were in a different Dollar Tree, not in our local one, when we found these. So anyways, um, he did get three of the children's one they say for kids fashion mask one size fits most so he picked up this one uh it's cute it's got the mint green background and it has some little mermaid kitties i think i'll go ahead and open this one so these would be perfect for my daughters um let's see hopefully well, these look kind of small, but I don't know. They'll fit my grandchildren anyway. Um, that is smaller than I thought it was going to be. Um, but I'll have them try it on and see. It's super cute. Love the color. So, yeah, he got two of this one. And then this one has a unicorn and rainbows really cute I will be on the lookout for some more of these but in the adults he did grab the this one adult mask now if I would have known these were that small I would have had him you know grab more of this one they are reusable washable comfortable says not for medical use for civilian use only so <clears throat> Now this is the adult size one, which they are stretchy, so we'll just have to try them on and see. This one is like a camouflage print, if you can see that. So I was happy to find them. We'll see if they work out or not. I picked up some Assured uh, Cotton Rounds. The girls and I go through these quite a bit, so I uh, grabbed another one. You get 80 in a package, so grab those. I also picked up some cotton swabs. This is the 300 count, also the Assured brand. Uh, let's see here. I needed some parchment paper, and I found the part parchment paper pop-up sheets. I don't know, have you seen these before? I usually get the box with the roll of parchment paper, but this time I've seen these durable parchment paper pop-up sheets. Now, they may have been there all along, and I just didn't see them, but you get 25 sheets in there. I like to use these in my crafting as well as, you know, in the kitchen. It says made in the USA. They're non-stick, easy cleanup, no cutting, no tearing. I probably will grab more. Probably every time I go in, I'll try to remember to grab a box so I'll have them. Get a little stash of them. So, got that. Uh, so I did pick up some hefty storage slider bags. This is the gallon. You get six in the package. It says it's a trial pack. And these are the stand and fill with the expandable bottom, so I really like that. I normally don't grab these, but I uh, needed some. We usually get them at Family Dollar, like my husband uses the coupon, and he stocks up on like the paper plates and garbage bags and storage bags. But I needed some larger ones, so <clears throat> excuse me, I went ahead and grabbed this one. I found this Dynamo color capture washing pads. 
It's uh, tin pads that trap dyes. So if you're washing uh, colors with whites, it will uh, keep the whites from the color bleeding into it. So they say. I've never uh, used these. But it says it keeps the colors brighter. So we will give it a try. I did pick up some pillow covers. I picked up three of them. They are by um, Home Collection. So I picked up this pretty gray, it's a little satiny. And I don't know if it'll fit my pillows, but <clears throat> I thought I would go ahead and grab them. I mean, they're only a dollar. I could use the material for something else if it doesn't fit or I can buy the polyfill and fill these and make pillows so I went ahead and got it it's an 18 by 18 inch and it has a zipper closure so I got the gray one and then I got two of this like beige beige colored one and I had planned on covering my zebra print pillows that are on my couch for fall so I'm going to try these and see if they fit. Those pillars are, are pretty large, so I'm not sure if it'll work, but I went ahead and grabbed those just in case. I did pick up this non-slip rug underlay. I needed it for a rug that's in the kitchen that's sliding a little bit. This is an 18 inch by 28 inch, and it's supposed to keep your area rugs from sliding around, so I went ahead and grabbed it. I will give it a try. Let's see. Uh -oh. I picked up this little basket. Um, it's just a clear, clear basket. has white handles. I don't know. I thought I could use this in the fridge for the yogurts. So I went ahead and grabbed it. And let's see. Okay, I picked up a pair of these like cat-eyed sunglasses. I thought these were super cute. They got the white frame. They're metal. Um, yeah, because I will need to be wearing protection over my eyes at all time. If I do uh, get to that place where I will be able to wear two contacts, I still have to protect my eyes with something over them. So... I went ahead and grabbed those. I love sunglasses. I have some, but I, you know, I'm not able to wear them because I wear glasses all the time. But when I used to wear contacts, I love my sunglasses. Okay, I picked up some socks. I found this one, which I thought is adorable. It has the pumpkin pie and then like the pumpkin pie spice latte. And the coffee cup. I just thought this was so cute for the fall. And these are um, the women's no-show socks. You get two pair. So I got this one. And then it has the black and white, uh, gray and white striped on the other pair. So I picked those up for me. They come in the five to nine size. And then I picked up this other two pack of socks for women's. But I grabbed these for my niece i'm putting her a little birthday um, just a little birthday gift together with a few dollar tree items and then i will be purchasing her some shoes she wants some new tennis shoes so i'm going to go look for her some air max tennis shoes and i just thought these were super cute so you get the pink the turquoise the white the black all my favorite colors in there and then you get the animal print, leopard print, in the pink and black with the blue background. So got that for her. I also picked her up a couple um, items out of the stationery, school supply section. And um, I ended up grabbing her this jot notebook with the ice cream cone. I did haul some of these previously 
but I don't think I grabbed the ice cream cone one. So I don't know. I seen it. I got it. I said she'll like that. It's a uh, 60 sheet ruled uh, notebook, 5.82 inches by 4.13 inches. So I grabbed that for her. And then I grabbed her this little pouch. I think I'm going to put some makeup, some girly stuff in there for her. It says always look up with the rainbow. And I know my girls like to get little bags with different little surprises in it. So I figure I would stuff this with some, you know, girly stuff for her. One of the items will be this Spa April's Bath and Shower Mermaid Face Mask. It is a repurchase. I've purchased these for my daughters before. So I went ahead and grabbed it for her. The picture shows it, that it has the mermaid scales. And uh, my daughter said they haven't used theirs yet. So I was curious to see if it actually looked like mermaid scales. So I grabbed that for my niece. Uh, okay, I grabbed this wrap cap. It's a bonnet. And it's supposed to help prevent breakage of the hair. So I went ahead and grabbed that. I mean, it does. it's supposed to work the same as a satin pillowcase, pretty much. So I went ahead and grabbed that for me. I also got me some mascara. I actually like this. It's the Wet n Wild Mascara. It's the Mega Wear, and it's in the Very Black. It is a repurchase. I've actually picked up quite a few of these in the past, and I'm finally running out, so I grabbed one. I picked up some Pure Silk Spa Shave Cream. This is the Ultra Sensitive, and I believe this also is a repurchase, but with three of us in the house shaving, we go through quite a bit of shave cream so I went ahead and grabbed this one I picked up this power stick 3-in-1 foam and body wash for my husband it's the cool blue water scent um, it's also a shampoo and conditioner it's 14 fluid ounces and I think he has used this before and I just saw this sitting there all by itself I don't know if it was out of place if they had more but I went ahead and grabbed this one when I saw it. They got in a new color slippers. You know they always carry the white ones and the pink ones. This time I found my favorite color. It's the mint green. And I just got them. I like to you know, throw these on if I'm taking out the garbage or something like that. <clears throat> it is in the extra large the extra large size is a nine and a half to ten and a half so I went ahead and grabbed grabbed a pair I mean they're they don't last very long but I mean if you're just wearing them around in the house you know they do the job especially my feet are always cold so I like to keep something on my feet so usually I have on some socks and some slippers so I got those just I love the color I did pick up some new, well, I don't even know if they're new. These are wizard, um, what do you call them, air fresheners. Um, I don't know if it's a new scent or not. Uh, it's Hawaiian Retreat, and it's a large can. You get 10 ounces. And then I also picked up the Sweet Vanilla and Lavender. I think Wizard's been around for a long time. This seems like a, a old, old school brand, Wizard. Just, I don't know, it just seems familiar to me. So I got both of those. Now, let's see, where's the time at? I can't see. Excuse my big face, I was trying to see the time, but I don't see it. I hope it is recording. <laughs> Oh, if it's not recording, I will be redoing this video. Okay, in the uh, Crafter Square section, I did pick up this adhesive cork sheet. I thought I could make some embellishments out of it. I think I saw Dear Julie Julie use this to make some embellishments. Not for sure if that's what it was, but I saw this and that's what it reminded me of, so I went ahead and grabbed it. I like that it has the adhesive backing. 
it's an 11 and three quarters by seven and three quarters inch uh, sheet. You only get one sheet in here. I did pick up some Jot computer paper. I've hauled this uh, paper in the past. Not this print, I don't think. Now that I'm looking at this one, though, I may have hauled it before. But that's okay. I always can use this paper. Um, you get 24 sheets. And I like to use these in my junk journals. And then this one here is a cat theme. A happy birthday cat theme paper. Which would go great in my cat journals. So these are 8.5 by 11 inch. And like I said you get 24 sheets. They're pretty thin but they, you know, they work nice in the journals. I did pick up one of the Jot binders. I just thought that was super cute. I love the pink and black uh, leopard print it says you glow girl so I thought that was cute I will be using this um, probably to organize like some of my girly ephemera or something I don't know I had to have it it's a one inch three ring binder so went ahead and grabbed it Let's see, I did pick up this little uh, pencil case. Well, no, this is not a pencil case, but it will be used as a pencil case. It's a cosmetic bag. And it has the different uh, planets and their stars, and it has the different signs. Gemini, that's what I am. There's Cancer, Taurus, Leo, a Scorpio, and Cancer. Where's Aquarius? I don't see Aquarius. I think Virgo is up there in the stitching, looks like. That's the only one I don't see. Or Sagittarius. I don't see that one either. But anyway, I thought that was super cute. And I'm going to use this. I have different journals for different things. So my dream journal. I have a dream journal where I keep track of dreams. I If I don't write it down right away, I forget the dream so if I wake up and I just had a dream or whatever I go ahead and write down the parts that I remember so I think I'm going to keep like my stickers and uh, pens or whatever that I use for my dream journal anything that I want to put in the dream journal for decorations I'm going to put it in this little pouch I just thought it went along with dreams so I went ahead and pick that up I did get I think a couple packs of stickers I think I only grabbed two I grabbed this one from crafter square with the little desserts I just thought that was super cute um, look at you get a jelly bean and a yellow gummy bear there's ice cream candy cupcakes so I thought it was cute uh, you get six in this package but, you know, they're large stickers. I also grabbed this one. You get 11 stickers. These look like metal, but they have the pineapple and the, you know, the toucan. It says forever. There's a flamingo. So I thought those were pretty. They're puffy. So I went ahead and got them. I did pick up a couple of the Essentials Collapsible Storages. I got a pink one that says shine every day. It's pink and like a light blue. Really girly. And then I picked up this one. It says this girl can. It's got the mint green and coral. My favorite colors. So I went ahead and got those. They will be used probably in this area here. Um, this area is mainly is two tables this way and then one goes the other direction over there but at, this is where I have like my um, scrapbooking set up where I plan on starting back to do my pictures getting those scrapbooked so this is the area that I have down at the opposite end of this basement is where I do all my crafting so I decided to start trying to film down here again. I will see how the lighting is. It was kind of dark before, and I'm hoping that 
with this phone it looks a little bit better down here I'm not sure if not I will I don't know I'll switch it up anyway sometimes I don't feel like carrying everything down I'd rather just go ahead and um, film in the living room or in my bedroom I think my bedroom has the best lighting but we'll see we'll see how it goes I did pick up some Jot Mechanical Pencils. This is a four pack. Um, I just thought those were really, really cute. And they have like a gripper at the bottom. And uh, my daughter was asking for some mechanical pencils. They will be starting back school virtually um, on September 1st. So I really hadn't picked up any school supplies. They don't really need any. Um, but she did ask for some mechanical pencils. So I did find this package of the Zebra Mechanical Pencils, which is a good buy because now instead of four pencils, they have increased it to eight. So, yeah, I went ahead and got them. It's number two lead, and they're really pretty. Really pretty print. Floral. They're all floral prints. I picked up some of the Jot glue sticks, 8-pack. This is the time to get them. You don't want to get too many because they'll dry out. But I did pick up one pack of the 8-pack because I like to use glue sticks when I'm gluing down images from magazines and stuff like that in my glue book. I use it in my journals. So, nice to have on hand. Um, I picked up some birthday cards for my niece and my two nephews they all have birthdays right here together one two of them was just yesterday and the day before and one of them will be um, Monday no yeah Monday oh, oh I dropped one so I picked up these were the two for a dollar I picked up this one part of your way with the headphones and has the lime green envelope it says you you deserve to have a birthday that's as awesome as you now i had to pick these really fast it was hard for me to see i had went to a dollar tree out of town where i had went to the eye doctor and they had dilated my eye my good eye the one that i actually see out of which it's not good but it's the one that i can see out of so you know, I still can't see out of the left eye, so I had a hard time trying to pick out cards. So pretty much grabbed <laughs> the first or second one that I saw. So um, I do like the colors. This one says "Happy Birthday," and these are for the boys. It has a turquoise envelope in the inside. It says, "With every birthday, you get a year smarter, a year nicer, and a year more special." Hope it's a great day. So I picked up two for my niece, one for my girls to give them, which it is their, she is their cousin and their god sister. She is my goddaughter. So I got this one. It says, it's your day sister with the turquoise envelope. And then the inside it says, hope you have a fun pack, super amazing, happy, happy birthday. So the girls would give that to her. And then I just grabbed this one. It says, for a sweetie who's loved so much. I like the cute little treats that are on there. It has the pink envelope. And I just usually grab an envelope that I think coordinates with it. Because usually the way they set up the envelope that's with it doesn't match. So pretty much with all these, I switched envelopes. It says, sparkling with laughter and sprinkled with fun. Sure hope that this birthday is your happiest one. So I got that for her. A few more items. I did pick up some of these Scrub Buddies vinyl gloves. The 10 pack. I usually pick up the latex one. I don't know. I just grab these to see how they are. You get 10, uh, 10 gloves in the package. Uh, one size fits all. Fits either hand and it says multi-purpose. So I went ahead and got those. I did pick up some Crafter Square glue sticks. I needed more. I probably will be, excuse me, working on some fall crafts really soon. So, grabbed a pack. And this is a 20-piece 
package of glue sticks. I picked up a novelty pen. You know, I love my novelty pens. I don't know. See, I have a bunch here. And I have another container over there with some in it. And then I have a container upstairs in my bedroom with all my mint green and turquoise ones in there. I picked up this kitty cat. It's a pom-pom kitty cat with the sparkly ears and sunglasses. I thought it was cute. So I grabbed that and it's going to go right in my cup there. I did pick up a pom-pom keychain for my niece to throw in her little pouch. And it's so cute. It's the mint green. I wanted it for myself, but then I said, I don't really need it. So I'm going to give that to her. It has the silver glittered ears and some glittered sunglasses and some little googly eyes. It's really soft. So it's just a little keychain. Really cute. And let's see here. I found some ribbon. I picked up two of the gingham ribbons. These are nine feet. I got the one with the green and white and then the pink, pink and white to add to my ribbon stash. I also picked up uh, one of the lace ribbons. I love using these in my journals. So I grabbed another one. It's like that off-white beigey color. Nine feet of that. I picked up some more of the rich art art what is it acrylology premium acrylic paint this time i picked up the white so now i have a few bottles of this paint so grab the white i can always use white and the last item is a soft lips lip protectant this was new and i went ahead and got it it's in the tropical coconut says hydrate delightfully so you know soft lips is a name brand so i went ahead and grabbed that so that is my haul um, i hope you like it if you do please give this video a thumbs up feel free to share it um, comment tell me uh, what you liked out of this haul and I hope if there's something in this haul that you see that you like that you're able to find it at your local Dollar Tree. Sometimes you got to travel a little bit to find some of the items that you're looking for. I know I definitely do. My Dollar Tree, my local Dollar Tree normally um, gets things in slower so sometimes I have to venture out. Um, but until the next one everyone stay blessed. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.